yeah hi everyone this is Ankit so we are back with the part 2 so like in the part 1 we have already seen how to fill F1 visa application and how to make a payment and today we'll be seeing like after making a payment how we can book a visa slot so as I discussed earlier like in in part 1 of the video we have already seen the filling of application as well as paying of visa fee that is one hundred and sixty dollar eleven thousand eight hundred and forty rupees as per the today's US dollar conversion rate and today we are going to see part two which will show us like how we can book visa slot as well as our biometric date slots so again like you will need your user ID password again the same user ID password you have to use and after using the same user ID password like in the receipt number automatically a receipt number will come you you have to not write anything manually here as soon as you will go to this page a pop-up will come use the existing receipt you have a new receipt use the existing receipt so you have to click on use existing receipt and automatically a number will come here so let's go back here let's log in okay yeah we are back here we, I can see that no appointment has been currently scheduled so what we need to do right now you can see the first available appointment is Thursday that is May 2nd 2019 so this date is falling in between the period of 120 days so yeah I can take this date and I have to click continue button and I'm not going to create a new application now so click continue you will again see like okay where do you want to if you if you want a premium privilege services where your passport will be dispatched to your home address then you can opt for that else if you're living in a Mumbai Delhi then you can directly go to the consulate and then you can collect your visa so I'm just choosing Mumbai because I will go there and I will collect my passport and I can click on continue button as soon as I'm clicking this continue button you can see that I can still not see the receipt number but I will I will click on confirm button and it will say you have one receipt that can be used for this transaction if you would like to use the existing receipt please press use existing receipt so anyhow like I went to Axis Bank I I went to their counter I have deposit I have deposited like dollar 160 to them that is 11,840 rupees and then they told me that after like one day your receipt will be displayed so you can click on use existing receipt and you can see now automatically a receipt number is key so nothing to enter like manually here it will come automatically and then we can click on continue button and this is the fee which I paid on Axis bank counter it can vary based on dollar rate conversion so today's conversion rate is 70.50 yesterday also it was the same but I really don't know why they charge for 74 click continue button okay now schedule OFC appointment this page is for scheduling OFC appointment select Mumbai location so I, I really can't see the dates okay Uh, 
I believe I can use the 26th one Friday on Friday I can go at so if OFC appointment is nothing but like you will go for your biometrics so this is the one which we were talking about so first we have to schedule OFC appointment so I can take any time let's go early then 8.30 will be good Friday April 26, 2019 Continue Now schedule counselor appointment App Applicant for US visa are required to appear in person for a visa interview at the US Embassy Consulate Please schedule an appointment for an interview So I am clicking this button I need 2nd of May Timing will be 10-15 will be perfect Available you can see 36 available are there But yeah 10-15 will be perfect Click on continue button Your appointment has been scheduled Please click on the link to share. Okay. To email confirmation, page as a PDF attachment. Please enter your email ID. So recheck your email ID. Okay. Yeah. Email appointment confirmation. You can click this thing or like download appointment calendar printable version. Let's click this one. seems an email will come okay printable version okay so this is how the appointment confirmation letter will look like so my name passport detail visa okay the date is oh, I will use OFC date is 26th of April 8.30 am and then visa date is on 2nd of May document delivery option you can see pick up one and this is my DS160 confirmation number so that means I need to carry my DS160 confirmation printable page this is UID and then you have several instruction what document do I need to bring appointment confirmation letter that is this one your current passport and mostly recent expired passport so yeah take your passport along with you print out DS-160 confirmation page you have to take DS-160 confirmation page on which the barcode number is there supporting document for your application as applicable so yeah you should have a bank letter a loan sanction letter as well as like liquid amount stating like okay this much amount is there in your uh, account and with the bank seal or something as well as I believe you can carry the valuation of your property and several different things documents and photograph for any children under age 14 but I believe like I am just going alone so I don't have this point as a valid point who should come to the appointment only visa applicant may attend the appointment okay so no one can enter building okay when should I arrive at exactly the time of your appointment so if I am booking like 10 a.m. or 10 15 a.m. I should reach at that point of time 
what item I can bring everything is mentioned here okay so I believe like we have already scheduled our visa appointment and the same thing is mentioned here also yep great then you can cancel your appointment you can reschedule your appointment emergency request group scheduling okay but but looks like you can reschedule your appointment so if, if you see a date is again coming like if you are not available in 2nd of May something is going like, like you know that you have to re reschedule it you cannot meet on the same day so then click on reschedule option and then again select the dates so this is how it works so we'll again log out from this thing what we'll do we'll again log in and check whether our dashboard has been updated or not now you can see appointment confirmation May 2nd 2019 1050 document delivery information is there okay so yes appointment has been confirmed if I click on this appointment confirmation page again the same page will come here so yeah this is how like I like like after making a payment you can go back to the same website use the existing receipt after 24 hours if you are paying at Axis bank counter after 24 hours it will get reflect if you are paying online it may take two days that is 48 hours in order to reflect the receipt so always if, if you are unable to see the receipt number after 24 hours or 48 hours you, you no need to worry like click you have to click that new exist existing receipt or something so yeah this is all about like how you can book a visa slot i hope you like the video if you like please subscribe the channel and thank you so much for listening all this stuff keep learning keep sharing bye bye